Mechanical pressure switches from Weka are available in various sizes and designs. All of these pressure switches have the same procedure for setting switch points. We will show you the procedure using the example of a compact mechanical pressure switch. Specific information on the switches can be found in the respective operating instructions. Weaker mechanical pressure switches are supplied with preset switch points. However, you can adjust the switch manually. You will need the following equipment. A comparison test pump, a sufficiently accurate reference instrument, such as a digital pressure gauge, a continuity tester or a signal lamp as a signal transmitter, as well as a suitable tool for adjusting the switch point, an Allen key or screwdriver, depending on the pressure switch. Screw the pressure switch into the pressure source. Connect the continuity tester to the electrical connections. Turn the adjustment screw for the switch point fully in clockwise. The switch point is now set to the highest possible value. Now apply the desired switching pressure to the pressure switch. As soon as the control pressure gauge indicates the desired value, turn the adjustment screw anti-clockwise until the continuity tester reacts. The instrument has switched. The correct switch point is now set. Check the result by approaching the point again. Due to the hysteresis, the reset point is below the switch point. If the switching relevant to your application is at the reset point, proceed as follows. Increase the pressure until the instrument switches. Now let the pressure drop until the reset point is reached. Adjust the adjustment screw and repeat this process until the desired reset point is set. So you see, Adjusting the switch points of our mechanical pressure switches is quick and easy. All weaker pressure switches can be supplied from the factory with the switch points you require. If you have any further questions, please get in touch with your weaker contact.